diminished. Diminished. On behalf of the President of the United States of America, we appreciate you allowing your loved one to die for freedom. I apologize that they were under-resourced, poorly trained and poorly equipped. I present this flag shaped like a heart to symbolize where we broke your family. You get a gold star as well. You get stories to tell in order to compel others to fight for freedom. Sometimes, many times, often times, when I tell a family their loved one is not coming home, I lie a little. Every time I lose someone in combat, I die a little. Dear Mr. Smith, your wife gave her life for freedom. But what is heard is blah, 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 and they are never coming home. Dear Mrs. Johnson, I regret to inform you that I lost your husband in war. Dear Mrs. Jones, today your son was lost in battle. I don't want to discourage anybody from service, but when I'm reminded of the cost of freedom, I cry a little. If someone doesn't return from a mission, I wonder why a lot. What did I do wrong? Did I say the right things? What else could I, should I have done? War has made me a slave to the grave. Struggling to find reasons to live. I have nothing else to give from PTSD. I cannot hide. Mm. Just now, another veteran has died. A weapon of choice is suicide. This veteran is, su is survived by pain, grief, hopelessness, and depression. This is sad. Makes me want to gag. This family is broken and all I have to give them back is this fucking flag. Service personnel dodge bullets in war and peace. War is an unleashed beast that loves the feast. It is clear that war makes the mind brittle. PTSD makes me committal a one-way ticket to the mental hospital because every time I lose somebody in combat, I die a little. Can you even see the human remains of me on behalf of the President of the United States? United States military and a grateful nation, please accept this flag as a symbol of our appreciation for your loved ones, honorable and faithful service. Hey. All right, keep that love going. Come on, let's get that love, that energy. We're gonna do this right. Put your hands together for victory. Yes, victory is in the real name.